learn how to color list boxes, multi-column list boxes, tree controls and tables. Follow these steps to change the color of the headers or cells of list boxes, multi-column list boxes, tree controls and tables. Right click the control and select visible items, row headers to show the row headers and visible items, column headers to show column headers or visible items, column header if only the header option is available or you are using list box. Using the coloring tool, right click a non header cell to display the color picker and select a color for all cells. Using the coloring tool, right click a row header to display the color picker and select a color for all row headers. Using the coloring tool, right click a column header to display the color picker. and select a color for all column headers. Using the coloring tool, right click the top left header cell of the control to display the color picker. And select a color for the top left header cell. We can use the active cell property to sell the to set the row and column of the active cells programmatically. Then we can use the cell background property to set the background color of the active cells programmatically. So let's apply a color to this upper left box. Uh, the indexes of the columns are minus 1 and the indexes of the rows are minus 1. So this would be minus 1, minus 1. Let's give it a color. So let's give the headers a color. All headers, uh, all to select all columns, let's select minus 2. Let's select all rows. Minus 2 is all rows.
then let us revert this color which is minus 1. Let us change the color of all rows and all columns now. Let us revert the upper uh, uh, all columns. then all rows and the upper left corner. 